Hello YouTube, it's Edmund. I'm going to show you how to fix this error on Audacity. So regardless of if it says line 6, line 9, well line 8, because there's only 8 lines. But regardless, I'm going to show you how to fix this immediately and you can get back to your project. Now first off, I want to make, I want to let you know that you must have these data files and the AUP in the exact same folder or on your desktop. If you don't, then you won't be able to open this file, period. Or you'll open it and there'll be no data. <clears throat> so first thing, you need Notepad++. Notepad++ is a text edit program that allows you to edit um, well text in different files and such. Um, you'll need to download 64-bit unless you have a 32-bit um, system most most of the time especially now most people have a 64-bit uh, but if you're not sure you can always type in at the bottom my computer and you'll see something like this and right here it says system type and it says 64-bit so once you download this it'll go through a whole process <clears throat> then go back to the file where your file is so this is my file right here I'm using as a test I'm going to close this for example now when you, once notepad plus plus is done downloading you need to right click and you'll see edit with notepad plus plus click that <clears throat> Now, it might look confusing to you at first if you're not used to seeing stuff like this. Also, I would want to mention you can use another text edit. Notepad++ is not, not required and it's free, but I would not recommend Notepad, regular Notepad that comes with the computer. So, as you can see, you're probably really confused unless you're used to seeing this <clears throat> right here where it says name title and then space value in red and then it says free blah 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 this right here it, you see there's this basically special characters are the reason the file is broken so you do not want any special characters where it says value um, even in the comments, I got rid of them. So, where it says uh, the and symbol, uh, the pound sign, just get rid of all of this. It's not going to hurt your file at all. It's just basically the name. For example, if you put in an instrumental while you were recording, then that's the main reason why this is happening. So delete this. All you have to do is highlight this section value to end. Keep the quotations backspace or delete. Do the same thing with the description above that. Backspace. Um, same with this. You can keep, I could keep this, but just to be cautious, delete that. Same with this one right here. And once that, oh, nope, there's another one right here. Right here, keep the quotations. And then up here at the up left corner, you should see a button that says save. I believe it's a floppy disk. <clears throat> then exit. Once that is done, you open Audacity again with that file. And there you go. You have your exact file back. And everything is perfectly fine. Also, you can open this way before uh, through the program. You can open this way. Oh, well, it's open in another window. But you get the idea. So once that is done, all you have to do is save and you'll be perfectly fine. Also, I would recommend creating a backup. And 
what, say you're not using Notepad++, say you just want to use Notepad, I would not recommend it at all. I tried it and I corrupt um, one of my files. Thankfully, I used a backup. But if you're going to use another program, Note program, instead of Notepad++, I would recommend creating a backup unless you know exactly what you are doing. And thank you for watching my video. I hope this helped you and keep working on your projects.